uh, morning, afternoon, evening, uh, whatever it is, wherever you are. Um, so what I'm doing today is I'm going to be uh, administering an oxalic acid drip treatment uh, onto the bees. So I'll just give you some background first. So October, middle of October, honey super came off. They had an Apid Life Var treatment for five or six weeks. Um, that came off end of November. Then mid-December, they had an oxalic acid drip treatment. Um, and that's the last time they've been touched. It is now the 15th of February. It's about 12 degrees outside the daytime. Sun's out. It's only going to drop to about seven degrees tonight so it's quite mild so it's an ideal time to uh hit them with the treatment so what i'm going to do is i'm going to um, administer an oxalic acid drip treatment that's going to get the varroa mites on the bees in the hive the way you're going to do that is going to drip about five mil of solution in between each frame of bees which i'll show you when i'm doing it and what varroa mites do is they like to hide in the brood. So they go in the brood before it's capped, when it's an egg or a larvae, before it's capped, then the brood gets capped over, they stay in that capped brood. When the brood emerges, the young bee, the mites are on it. So to that end, what we're gonna do is then, in two weeks time, so we're gonna hit them again with a second treatment to get any brood that's emerged since. The brood stays capped for 12 days, so 14 days time, you know, that worker brood will have emerged We'll hit on the second treatment um, and I'll bring you back for that. At that point also it'll be the beginning of March so I'm going to set the hive up ready for the spring honey flow. Um, so if you want to see that subscribe hit that notification bell just so you don't miss the video if you want to see it of course. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to get the smoker lit, get the bee suit on and I'll see you at the hive. Right, what I'm going to try and do here is I'm going to try and take the super off with the crown board at the same time in a wanna. Lovely cluster of bees. Now what I'm going to go ahead and do is I'm just going to drip four mil, five mil between each frame. See down in those frames there, the bees look to have some stores still. So we'll take a frame out and have a quick look. Lots of capped honey still, so they're doing fine. I will leave block of fondant on as an insurance policy.
Right, so that's the drip treatment complete. Um, a quick look in there, as you see on that frame, they've got loads of stores in there, plenty of stores left, um, which is good to know when we open them up. At the end of the month, for two weeks time. So if you want to see that video, when I'm going to be doing a full hive inspection, setting uh, the hive up ready for the summer, uh, spring honey flow, uh, like, subscribe, and come watch that video. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.